pitch right down the middle for a strike at 94 miles an hour. We haven't seen Alec Hansen hit 98, which is what Bob Macaluso said he, he's touched. He's been, I think he's topped out about 95 right. so far. And solidly hit over the shortstop, no, noisy. And Deaton is on with a single. Designated hitter, number 30, Dustin Fraley. Dustin Fraley with the Johnny Cash walk-up music. Noisy's six feet tall. If he was 6'2", he would have caught that ball. Fraley got on base in the first inning with by was hit by a pitch. And Hansen, not messing around, looks back over. Fraley's a couple hits last night has now risen his average up to 462. His on base is 548. I think the runners will definitely take that all season if he's able to sustain right. it. And strike one for Alex Hansen. Hansen consistently in the 94 mile an hour range, almost every single pitch that he's thrown that's been a fastball. Like you said, we've not seen the big high 90s yet. The off speed pitch at 80 miles an hour, one and one to count now. So again, this top of the order here, we've got Fraley and Metzger Metzger's on deck right now. Fraley's submission was hit by a pitch, and Metzger singled in his last at bat. So Fraley, Fraley's a junior out of uh, Alta Loma, California. Transfer out of Mount San Antonio Junior College. My former stomping grounds, Alta Loma High School. And he's gonna steal, and he's gonna get there. And they just did, so well done. Stolen base by Deaton. His first steal and first stolen base attempt of the season. So that gets a little pressure on things with no out here. 2 1 is the count to Fraley. Good pitch to throw on there for the catcher. It was uh, right down the middle, fastball, but uh, the throw sailed a little bit toward the second base side of the bag. Fouled away. That was a 95 mile an hour fastball. I think he's gonna be bearing down now with runner in scoring position. Two, two pitch, now that high, and it's gonna bring a full count in. He has gone to breaking pitches a few times, uh, but usually that's when he's ahead of the count. Let's right. see, with the, f with the three, two count, nobody out. Number two hitter in the order here, and then you got the three, four, five coming. It uh, might be challenge time for Alec Hansen. Curveball, great pitch. Got him. Well, that's the second time we've seen that tonight. No way in the world would Fraley be looking for that kind of pitch. He's gotta be looking dead red. Third strikeout for Alex Hansen. Second time he's got a guy looking on that big fat curveball. That's, that's you know good pitching and it kind of keeps your offense, the hitters off balance. If they think he can throw that thing over the plate at any count. It, now Metzger who singled in his first time at bat. He's had four hits in the series thus far. Had a single, double, and triple last night. People are showing up with blankets. They That's must think it's going to get a lot colder. I guess so. It's actually really nice. Maybe they're going to use it to sit on. Looks like the seats are about 80% full here, the uh, permanent seats here at Hartfield. A few empty ones, but uh, good turnout tonight. The grass berms on each side has a lot of people down there in lawn chairs and a few standing. One, one, and, oh, sorry, one and one, the count right now. John Farron shows me it's 77 degrees. Hey, we're down, it's, that, that that's temp's freezing. dropping. That's dropping like a rock. 85 earlier. The pitch, inside but high, two and one. Outfield straight away, medium depth. 
Infield backed up. Deaton has decent speed at second. He's got a nice lead. Nobody really holding him on. That's where he's got a gap there in the left center. There's that breaking the pitch again. That, he's had good luck with that I think pitch. You want to see that, don't you? I mean, if you're if you're a scout, you want to see some variety. Yeah, sure. Again, if he's got the feel for that pitch tonight. Yep. Uh, And I think it's had a good crowd. He just called a balk. They just called oh, a balk wow. on Hanson. So that, that advances Deaton over to third right. base. So uh, runners now have a chance to, uh, and now the infield, the corner infield is first and third. Now start pull even with the bags. The infield is still back up the middle. So any kind of ground ball to second or short will score the tying run. Bach was called by the home plate umpire that time. Didn't hesitate. Full count now on Metzger. Max Carter, the cleanup hitter, is on deck. And walked him. Still tried that breaking pitch again. This time it was high. So runners at the corners now. And he was ahead in that, that count, Jeff. Gotta wonder if the Bach might have unsettled him just a smidge, might have right. taken a little bit of the concentration away. Carter looking down at Coach Bob Macaluso, the renegade or the Roadrunners head coach. And now the pitching coach for Jamie Pinzino, the pitching coach for Oklahoma, is going out to have a little chat with Hansen. And everyone's gathering around Macaluso. Uh, Max Carter was looking down there to see if a uh, possible squeeze bump right. might be in order. Just reading where they get their, a lot of their guys. Yeah, it's interesting. Oklahoma does a good job of recruiting nationally. A lot of guys from Oklahoma, but you do see Hunter Haley. Uh, they've got guys in there from, from California, Carlsbad, and Great Oak High School in Temecula, guys who we have not called their names of yet. Um, well, they were here scouting yep. the Stockdale pitcher yesterday. So uh, right. he's only a sophomore, but they're already t he's on their radar. That's yep. what that tells me. Keaton Hernandez, who was their starting pitcher yesterday out of Palm Springs, Desert Chapel High School, but went to community college in, in uh, Oklahoma. They do a great job of, of, of recruiting their state. That's for sure. Majority of their players from 11 of their uh, players from Oklahoma. Five from California, including Flansburg, Hernandez, Martinez, Mendenhall, and Wagner. And another stolen base. Metzger took off on the first motion. And um, again, with the uh, the Sooners concern about, will Seelman try to race home? He, they just concede second base. So now right. a base hit by Max Carter can put uh, the Roadrunners ahead. Single to the outfield will probably score a pair. First pitch is out of the strike zone, 1-0. Swing and a miss. That's Big a cut. challenge. That's yeah. a challenge fastball right there. He struck out Carter the last time they met. That was right up, you know. That 93 was, miles an hour. That was right down the middle and saying, here it is, son, see what you can do with yeah. it. Two on, one out. Fouls it away. Another one, another challenge fastball. Yep. Carter was right on that one, fouled it straight back. The pitch and hit right back to the second baseman. That'll score a run and that will tie this game up. Messinger rolls over to third. That's a potential go ahead run. Deaton comes in to score to tie this thing one to one here. So the run runners convert a single, a walk, a stolen base, and a balk into a run. Gusbeth, who's still waiting to get on track offensively, hitting below 200, began the night at 196, grounded out to third, his first appearance with uh, runners on second and third in, in the first inning. Got another chance here with runners in scoring position. A runners with Metzger over at third. Owen won the count. Pitch 
Pitch outside. One all. Grote John, the third baseman, is on deck. Hoping to get a chance to hit in this inning. Outside with that slider. Two balls and a strike. Gusman's a, a little sneaky. Infield back, you know, third baseman's well behind the bag. You almost think, would he think about dropping a bunt down the third, third baseline and get the go-ahead run in on a bunt attempt? Swing and a miss. Uh, it, it looked like he tried to hold up on it, but he got committed to it. It looked like it was a pitch right down the middle yeah. anyway, actually. Yeah. That I don't want to swing at that, but it's coming right down the middle. Yeah. I'll go ahead. Ah, uh, maybe not. <laughs> that evens the count at two and two. Yeah. Two out. Mets Grover at third. Here's the pitch. And right down the middle. Got him looking. How many guys you got looking, Jeff? Are you keeping that stat? Yeah, I do. That's that's the uh, fourth strikeout, and all four are looking. 